my beloved love. And I feel that this has been coming up, because someone may have been feeling a bit of self-judgment coming out around some of this, and I feel you being asked to really see yourself with love, to see how far you've come, to see how well you are doing so much of the time of really maintaining your balance, being such a light in this world. I see you being like that star in a very dark sky, one who is actually guiding and leading others in ways that you may not even be fully consciously aware of. So, I'm going to be reshuffling some of the cards here. I feel like many of the messages coming out today have been words of encouragement from someone's spirit guides. So I'm really going to let this reading just carry us where it wants to go. And thank you for keeping such an open mind and heart, and of course, for sharing your own powerful energy here in this reading. You are more than a passive listener, you are actually an active co-creator here. And once again, we have the Divine Timing card. What else can I channel about this Divine Timing at play? So, how are these two energies facing off here with the Crown Chakra and the Thinking Man? Okay, so time is the biggest factor here. When I speak of time, what I really mean is there is a subconscious unravelling of old ego-based programming that is happening very naturally and very automatically in whoever I am speaking about here. I see this almost representing here as well the facing off of the 3D mentalities against the 5D mentalities because I feel as though someone may have found themselves recently, perhaps in the last 18 months, for someone specifically, in that what we might call 4D space, where they are still feeling as though they are a little bit in a dark tunnel, walking blindly. They are beginning to fully hear the call of their own intuition and learn how to solidify that connection between the body and the soul, the thinking mind, and the intuitive self. And yet, oftentimes, that guidance is followed in a way that feels blind, that still creates feelings of uncertainty. You are more solidly on that higher vibrational pathway, and what that means is those who are engaging with karmic patterns, energies, lower vibrational frequencies, aren't able to connect with you consistently. But this person, I see them, their energy represented almost by a wave that goes up and comes down. So it's like sometimes they rise up to these higher timelines and connect with you, other times the energy lowers, they dip back down, and there is this natural disconnection here. Of course, there is no going back from a larger perspective so I'm talking temporarily here. This is very interesting. What else can I get from this card here? This feels like a lot of new energy flowing, even if it's an old connection for him. Yeah, it feels like someone has been in the energy of delay. It could be the other person here that has seemed to be sitting on the fence. It seems as though during this time, however, truth has been revealed to them, from Divine Muscular. Type yes, if you believe. <laughs>